What's up everybody, this is Sarish Fahd here. Today we are gonna cook an amazing and iconic dish of South India of Ke or Kerala. Uh, it's called Karimeen Pollichadu. It's pearl spot fish cooked in banana leaves. I'll show you how to cook it. It's mouthwatering recipe. Um, if you guys haven't subscribed to my video yet uh, or to my channel yet, make sure you subscribe. If you like this video, make sure you give a thumbs up and make sure to hit that notification bell so you'll know whenever I post a new video. So let's get cooking. Now we have our fish cleaned and scaled. I have added some slits in it for the masala to be absorbed well into the meat. Uh, let's see what all spices we use for this dish. Now we have two parts here. One for frying and another one for making a paste. Let's start with the frying mix. Uh, in this we use chili powder, coriander powder, salt and turmeric. And we add a little bit of vinegar to it. And the next part is making a paste. Uh, for that, we will need tomato, shallot onions, red onions, ginger, garlic, and some curry leaves. And then we need some spices for it. That would be coriander powder, fennel seeds powder, salt, turmeric, and chili powder. So that's the second part. Let's get cooking. So let's add all the mixes for the frying together. Uh, add like two tablespoons of vinegar to it. And then rub it in and mix it in together with all the fish. Make sure you fill the, the slits so the flavor gets into the fish. Now we are going to make the, the gravy. When the oil is hot, you are going to add your onion. We add the same oil from what we cook the fish in. 
for more aroma. And we are gonna add our curry leaves. Okay, next we add in our sliced tomato. Now, let's add all our spices together. And keep mixing it for like two to three minutes. So once our dish is ready, add some coconut milk and stir it. Bring the coconut milk to a warm, warm temperature, lukewarm temperature. And then you can just close it and keep it aside. Now we have our fish and the gravy ready. Let's wrap it up. So to wrap, we need a banana leaf and it's just put in a heat fire or on the stove for a little bit so it's a little bit cooked and then we add our gravy just like a layer and then we add our fish and then we cover it with another layer of the gravy and once it's and once it's done let's wrap it up Make sure it's wrapped nice and tight. And then it goes back on the fryer. Now our fish is grilled and ready. Let's see how it tastes. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my god. <laughs> it smells so good. It's covered in the gravy. Oh my god, it's so good. It's so good. The banana leaves adds a lot of flavor, trust me. Okay guys, I'm gonna devour this. If you guys like the video, you know what to do. Hit the thumbs up. Until next time, see ya, Nandi, Namaskaram, thank you.